This is 2023. How you selling a 2023 Hyundai? It always feels right, it don't cost nothing, a beautiful life, make it mean something. We gotta spread the love, spread the love, spread that love. I'm starting to believe, it's life changing, setting me free, love is waiting. We gotta spread the love, spread the love, spread that love. Come on, give a little smile, it's a cherry on top Pass a little joy, make a heart go pop Love don't stop, it'll keep going, just watch What you give is what you get Everything is coming back What you give is what you get Gotta give till nothing's left It always feels right It don't cost nothing, a beautiful life Make it mean something, we gotta spread the love oh, I feel so much better, Jesus have you ever just took that nice long hot bath after cleaning up everything? The house is nice and clean. And you've taken that hot, long, nice bath. Y'all, I got rid of the gray. She's gone. Where does Miss Silver Fox go? Miss Silver Fox said no more. <laughs> oh, I couldn't do it, y'all. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I tried. I tried. I tried. I tried. It was looking real bad because the black and then it was gray and the gray was just like around here. It was like, no, what you trying to do, girl? I wait on you. I wait on you for a little bit longer. So, y'all, I had to get rid of that because she won cute. She won cute. I wake up in the morning. I was like, who that woman, Harpo? Who that woman? Who that woman be Harpo? So Silver Fox had to go. Silver Fox is no more. I'm like, no, no, no. So I did dye it back black. And now I am going to blow dry it. But before I blow dry it, I'm going to go in with some of this red can. Y'all can see that red can. Um, this is their uh, acidic bonding concentrate. And it helps keep my hair smooth. I love this stuff. And I'm going to go in with some of that. I need to go to Sephora, y'all. I need to go to Sephora. So with this, I just squirt it in my hand like that. And then... I'll take it and do this side and then I'll go in with the other and for the other side that much and I'm gonna go in with my blow dryer this stuff because it just like absorbs in your hair it doesn't make it sticky or anything it just or greasy or none of that I love it love it love it oh. So glad she's gone. The black is back. Miss Black is back. My lips are not dry. My lips are not cute though. My lips are dry. I'm just going in with some of this Atacha. This is the the Kiss You Lip Mask. I like it because it moisturizes your lips. And so now I'm gonna get my blow dryer. But before I get my blow dryer, I have been using this Vigamore Grow Serum, hair serum, that y'all was seeing all over TikTok. And I was trying to get like the middle of my hair thicker. So I was like, I'll try it. I'll try it. So as y'all can see, I have been trying it. And I know the size of my hair, it did grow in. That's why I need to go to Sally Beauty Supply Store, y'all. Because I ain't got none. It's like, it's a little bit in here. But I need a longer thing because it stops like right there. 
right where the solution is at. Mm. I don't think my other one is bigger than that. There you go. I don't want to ruin the palm of my head. Hands. I always wonder that. I'm like, okay, so if it's for your hair and you put it on your hands, <laughs> will hair grow out of there? Girl, squeezing it any harder ain't going to get it. So I put that up there. And so I am going to go in with just a little of my um, BB Heat Shield Thermal Protection Mask before I apply any heat to it. Okay, and then I'll go in with my dryer. Here's my dryer. So y'all should get loud, so y'all gotta excuse the noise. I'll play some music for y'all. I heard y'all like my music I play. Oh my, oh my Jesus, oh my God, won't he do it? I'm at 6,000, oh my God. <laughs> I know it don't seem like a lot. I just opened up my phone and I think yesterday I was like at 5,000 and like 80 something, 880 something. I opened up my thing and I'm at 6,013. Oh my God, thank y'all so, so, so much. I love y'all, I love y'all, I love y'all. Y'all are the best. I tell y'all, y'all are just, y'all are the chicks. I just love y'all. I looked at my thing and I was like, 6,000, what? <laughs> it's the little things in life, y'all. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and blow dry our hair. Look, never needed luxury Cause there's more to life you see What's the point of finery? If it fabricates a part of me If the clock was wrapped in gold Some would go bankrupt just for a taste uh, Some would even sell their soul Only to realize it was never worth the chase yeah, yeah. Material guns ain't gold What about your own gold? Your Finding gold. things never feel the void hey. It just robs people up to joy Don't get me wrong, nice things ain't bad Last a little while Simple life is how I ride I don't really need much I don't really need much It's the simple things that get you right That's the really good stuff Best believe Money can't buy this Cause it's so priceless Truly delighted Come on and try it People sacrifice all of their time To please someone who doesn't even try To reciprocate the effort So they end up buying some expensive leather Wasting energy on someone who don't know love They just want you cause you gotta got the big bucks You can buy designer things They want what you got, not the care you bring Material guns ain't gold oh. What about your own? Dry it. I'm gonna put my blow dryer up and then I'll get my flat irons and then I'll flat iron this baby. I'm the only one use hair ties for like when I don't have anything to tie it up with. Okay, now I'll get my flat irons. These are my clickers for my phone when I'm taking pictures. Taking pictures. My feet are so dry. I need to put some lotion on them. 
like when I move, you can feel the dryness. So I'll be back once I'm done with this process, y'all. She's a lot. She's a lot to deal with. I'm just going in with some silk therapy. And I normally put this all over my hair. And y'all, believe it or not, I was using Olaplex. And I think Olaplex was making my hair come out. I'm like, what? Every time I put Olaplex in there, I can comb it. And it just seemed like my hair just come out. So I'm <clears throat> so I'm stopped using Olaplex in my hair. And now way I guess is okay. But I was like, why? I don't even know what I did with my Olaplex. I probably got pissed off at her and threw her somewhere. I'm looking for my rosemary essential oil. So sometimes I put this in my hair, not a lot. Actually, since I've been putting that other stuff in my hair, I haven't even been using this. But before I was putting it in there, so I'm just going to put it like... That does make it oily, so I try not to put too much of that in my hair. Especially in the front. But my hair... Oh, my nose is just itching. My hair is like a sponge. It just literally absorb all of that oil oh my god so this morning y'all i woke up yesterday i kind of went to bed with a headache this morning i woke up i had a little headache but when i tell y'all my back was hurting so bad i'm like what the heck what the heck is going on it felt like like i have either laid the wrong way or i moved the wrong way and like if I moved, it feel much better now. But if I moved a certain way, it was just hurting. And I was like, what is going on? Oh, Y'all don't know how happy I am to have my hair back black. Although the other one wasn't bad, but I don't know. So I'm going to do this real quick, y'all. And I'll catch y'all in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Hooked on the took one time Climb on my top of my Pull on my strings like kite I don't move my left from right More than a fling on a weekend More than a side in a DM You got me on a hole oh, Another level Mama said I should be careful I admit it I'm under it your influence moving, pumping through my veins I'm tripping on your love Got me so fucked up coming down when you leave Jones in my bones, I'ma need Bring it on back to me I'll breathe it in, breathe it in deep Winning when I'm losing that sleep And loving and I'll talk a repeat and you got me on a whole, oh, another level Mama said I should be careful I Hey guys, so I am out, I'm going to go, well I'm out going to get something to eat <clears throat> I guess it's Culver's for the menu for tonight, for dinner I'm tired. I have been busy. Tomorrow I got a busy day. Oh, tomorrow I got a brunch. We're going to brunch. Uh, my husband and I. Yeah, I dyed my hair black. Oh my God, it looks so different because I'm normally seeing like white and gray. <laughs> and it just looks so weird just seeing all black. Oh my God. But we are on our way, or I'm on my way to Culver's to grab something to eat because I am starving. I haven't eaten all day i ate a bowl of cereal this morning it is 6 13 and i try not to eat after six my time frame that i try to eat is from nine to six but today is gonna be one of those days because i'm just eating at 6 13. had a busy day cleaning up my house really really good mopping the floors then i did my hair that took some time I got caught up in YouTube world, started watching videos, and now I'm on my way to get something to eat, girl. And my husband won a double burger, double butter burger. I think that's what it's called. And I'm just going to get me some fried shrimp. Although I haven't had fried food in a minute, but I have no, nothing else. I can go for some tacos, but... I think I'm just going to have the, um, the shrimp, fried shrimp. Although I get shrimp on my tacos too, but yeah. Everywhere is expensive, so it's not even, I can't even say I'll be saving money <laughs> going to Culver's because they both is about $40, so which is a crazy. Cobras may be a little bit cheaper. We're going to see, though. We're going to see. I think my meal is like 10-something. I think my husband's is 10-something. So maybe it's about 20-something. Not quite 40. But if I had to have the shrimp tacos, that would have been 40. That's, that's crazy. I think it's like $15 and something in their tax. But, yeah. So, that's where I'm headed. And I'm so tired. Oh my God. Come back and um, do nothing. When I come back, I'll probably show y'all a little quick haul with some items that I brought. But I'm going to do the try on haul on Monday. So y'all stay tuned for that. So I'll probably show y'all what I brought. I think actually I'm going to the store tomorrow up in um, Orlando. So we're gonna go out. Our plans are to go have brunch in at Cheesecake Factory. And then um, 
go to the Millennial Mall. I want to go to a couple of stores up there. And I have a gift card that I got for my birthday that I need to use that I have not used yet. So that's my plan, guys. So, yep. so I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Oh, yesterday. Oh, my God. I went and got my nails did. I meant to tell y'all yesterday. So I was going to get my nails did and I was like going to do a little shopping up there. Well, I got my nails did. I was going to take y'all with me and my battery died in the midst of me talking. So that's why you see nothing else from yesterday. Because this was going to be a weekend vlog. I did not know. I thought when I grabbed this camera that that battery was full. Um, I know they said the memory card was already was almost up so I changed my memory card and I thought the battery was good but girl as soon as I got in that car and I started talking that battery was like Beep. I was like what and I was a I was on the expressway when it happened so I couldn't turn around and I was like oh well I guess they can't come with me so whew, I did find some items <clears throat> that I will let y'all see once I get back home. But hopefully Cobra Lines is not long because I feel like Cobra Lines is always super duper long. Ah, uh, what? Just one car in the driveway? Oh my God. That is a rare. Very, very, very rare. So it's not a line, thank God. Thank you for choosing Cobra's Quick Fresh for you today. Um, yes, may I have your 10-piece shrimp basket? Oh, hey, would you like the cocktail sauce on the side with it? Um, yep, can I have about two of those? Those are going to be the meal with fries and a drink? Yes. Oh, hey, what would you like for the drink today? Um, I'll take a Sprite, and for the fries, can I have no salt? Sure, no salt, okay. And then can I have one of your, um, I guess the double butter burger? Would you like cheese on it? No. All right. Any toppings? Um, everything else, just no cheese. Like the lettuce, tomato, onion, and mayo. Yeah, that's cool. All right. And the double patty, okay? Uh, I'm sorry. The double patty, okay? Yep. Mhm. Mm would you like to make it into a basket as well? Yes, please. All right. Salt on the fries, okay? Or do you want no salt? Yep. No salt on them. Okay. And for the drink, can I have that? Um, a large Sprite with light ice. Large Sprite light ice, okay? And that'll be all. Would you like any ketchup in the bag? Uh, yeah, you can put some ketchup in the bag. All right, it'll be twenty-five fifty-seven at the window for okay. you. Okay, thank you. My pleasure. Okay. And can I have three um, shrimp cocktail sauces in it? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, no, I got this. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okie dokie. And then I'll just have you pull to the right behind that white uh, truck. Okay, thing. cool. Thank you. Man, I am so hungry, y'all. So, 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 so hungry. All right, so I'm gonna sit here and wait on my food and I will talk to y'all in a little bit. Food secured. Going home and smash. So hungry, so hungry. Oh my God, so the line 
it's like super duper crowded now. Cause I know when I got here, I was so shocked to see only one car in the drive. Okay, y'all. I'm finna jam on it with some music. I love you. Great. Love me some good old music. Hey guys, I just got in from church, so I am actually getting ready to get dressed. I'm taking off this church clothes. This is what I wore today. A gray suit. And I have on some black heels. But this is by Calvin Klein. A two-piece with a... I have on a two-piece gray by Calvin Klein with a tight button or a tight um, blouse up. And I wore gray or silver jewelry. But I'm actually getting ready to take off my stuff so we can head up to Orlando. I have some jeans I need to take back. So I'm going to do that. Hey, Chucky, you got a um a receipt in here. Did you need it for something? A pink receipt? So I am getting ready, guys, so we can head out. <clears throat> I am wearing a white sweatshirt that says Chicago with some black joggers that I picked up from Target. And I'm putting on some gold jewelry. How's y'all Sunday going, coming along? I hope y'all have a fabulous day. Y'all, my bun, I don't know what she doing today. Yep. Oh, you gotta go by that own um, thing. I should have did it yesterday, but I was out there fooling with that tree, trying to get that done. Okay, I need to wash these shirts. I was going to wear them today, and I had makeup on this one and makeup on this one, so. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'll meet y'all in the car. <laughs> so this is what I'm wearing really quick. I have on this uh, sweatshirt that says Chicago, black joggers, and gym shoes, and I'm camera at Louis Vuitton bag. Yep. This time I'm going to get another battery. Just in case. I'll clean up when I come back because my house is a mess. I got the jeans I want to take back. I got the two shirts I want to put in the laundry room. And I'll meet y'all in the car. I'm mess up that screen on the road trip. It's a suction on it. It's plastic. That's it. Man, I've been having like a click in my shoulder. Fucha. Who said, where's the gas station at? Is it that low? He said, yeah, I got 65 damn. miles. Yeah, yeah, come on, Dad. Don't drive your car like babe, that, Babe, it was not light. my come intention. On. I swear to God, when I went to get my, excuse me, when I went to get my leg you done. Go, go, go down there like the 192 and you stop at one, the station down there. I was going to. Um, That's cutting it close, 16 miles, probably from here 62. to 62, I mean 65 miles. I wouldn't do 16 miles. You didn't do that. <laughs> what? It's 65 miles. I was gonna stop and get some gas when um yesterday when I got my nails did and I totally forgot about it. And when I was on my way home, I was like, man, I forgot to get some gas and I was at home already. I have never drove turn that way to I never drove a car with my gas like come on. I don't it wasn't like intended. Is that um your neighbor? 
wasn't intended. Like I was just driving and be like, okay, I'm gonna drive my car till I got no gas. Which way I'm going? Going. To Gateway. Yeah. Get some gas right there. And, uh... Who drive their car? I'm mistakenly. Yeah. You need gas? No, serious. You need gas and you totally forget about it. And then when you get home, it's like, oops, I forgot to put gas in my car. So you wait till the light to come on, right? He think that I did it on purpose. I why? I say you do it on purpose. So why? It was an accident. I, I but really, how many times truly, you been saying you was going to get some gas and never get it? But normally I try to fill it up halfway so that I don't have to put all that money in it. It was just an oversight on my behalf that I forgot about it. How many times you drove this car? I forgot about it three times. Friday, yesterday, Saturday, yesterday. So you can say that the other two is deliberately because you forgot the first time. No, I forgot Thursday the too. Time, no, Friday when I went and got my nails did. They the were all time. forgotten. When right, I get right, in my car, I lie. forget. Y'all, I don't know why my neck is hurting so bad. But you sleep under that air conditioning and like turn it down some. It'd be at night and be nice if you throw the cover off too much you're hot. Turn it and then I, get up I, under the cover again. I don't know what it is. I like can you not turn this down a little bit. Sleep. You got it on six in a hot house. The house ain't gonna be hot. It may not be hot to you, but these hot flashes say it's hot. Well, it's your hot flashes, it's not the house. It'd be hot. I'm gonna put the uh, trees out. I tried, y'all. I was like, last night, I was like, I'm gonna get into bed. And all I wore was, and I know y'all probably say, well, just dress lighter. When I went to bed last night, all I had on was a gown, a little thin gown. And I got into bed, and I literally felt like I was about to be on fire. So I had to go turn the AC back down. I try to keep it at 74, but last night I had to put it on 73. Because <laughs> I was so hot. And now my back and my neck, my neck and my back hurt. And I have the cover up on me all the way up to my neck. So I don't know, child. I just been feeling real crazy today, but we gonna pray and keep it moving, right? Um, so we're headed to his job because he got to pick up something to take it somewhere. No, he's there. I'm just giving him his uniform while he's there. He's already there. Yeah, he's so why he can't get it? It's in he's your office. My, oh, up in my, uh, okay. My What's their uniforms? They everybody have to be in. Y'all have to be. You have to be in uniform too. Mm -mm. They change, they change the uniforms, Rob changed the uniforms for you. So guys, I have Mr. C here, as y'all see. What up? I have a new technique with my phone. I have it mounted onto the dashboard. Oh, you got it recorded, I ain't never shit, I ain't recorded. That works, oh my God, the motorcycle crew. Why do you want me to sit, let me know you can record. That works out much better than having it in my hand and it's falling. I ordered some more of those that I can have in the house. So that way, when I record now, I have places to put y'all. Because before, I did not have any places to put y'all. Nope, I left them in my other purse. Is there some back there in the box? Y'all, I wanna get my car washed this week. That I did do last Monday. And they did a horrible job. A horrible job. My husband was like, you got the car washed? I'm like, yeah. He was like, when? I'm like, when I went out. He was like, it don't look like it. He was like, you must have went through a pile of dust. I'm like, they didn't do a good job. Y'all, I literally had got the car washed, went to the grocery store. When I walked out of the grocery store, I passed up my car because it was a dirty Mercedes. And I was like, that ain't my car. And lo and behold that was my car I'm like I just got my car washed how is it dirty and I mean it's dirty I'm like what did they do just take it to the back and look at it and was like this car done and brought it back out I don't know I don't get it Listen, just remember y'all this same person we're talking to with the fuel light on I did go to the car wash and I sat there 
and I waited. I bet you if you call them, they'll be like, yep, she came in Monday or whatever time I it was. I wouldn't even claim their car wash because they ain't getting no car wash. I'm like, I don't know how you didn't know it when you came out the, uh, the deal and they said it was ready. Because when you take your car in to get service, you go through those garages, right? So when you get to the gate, the gate automatically opens up and then you drive through. There's three lanes. So there's a first, middle, and an end. And I went through the first lane. I went in. The guy came over and I asked him, I said, do you all have a time for a car wash? They was like, yeah. He went back. He got his tags. He came back. He wrote a tech, ticket number on it, gave me a ticket. And he was like, here you go. He was like, it shouldn't be long. I was like, okay, cool. So I went to the waiting room. I sat there for about maybe 30 minutes. And then he called Miss Crowder. I was like, yes. He was like, your car is ready. I was like, oh, okay, great. Thank you. Come back. Got in my car because the door was open. He had the door open. And I didn't look at the outside. And then when the lights are down, dimmed down, you really can't tell if the car was washed what or lights, not. What lights was the lights that's in the service in the service area when you take your car in and so that's what happened and came out and I don't think they washed my car I think they just took it back there had me sitting is that Byron behind us no that's a Chevy <laughs> so guys uh, that's where I, I'm at they said the other day, Palm Bay police was pulling people over on this road. Tierra told me the page to go to, to for uh, Facebook sale, to sell that um, desk stuff. So I got to go on there. Man, it was so many people selling their cars. I was like, people sell cars like that? I'm like, it got to be something wrong with these cars. They sell them for like $2,000. And this one person was selling a 19, a 20, 20, a 20, 19 for 2000. What kind of car was it? It had 80,000 miles on it. And what type of car? Here, I'll show you if it's still on there. I was like, people sell cars for that cheap? Hell no, you know I'm like, it gotta be that car had to be in a flood or something. Exactly, you know something wrong. Because the car looked really nice. 2019 for 2000 miles. Let me show you. I don't want Starbucks. There's still a lot of miles to have on a dog on 19. Unless you just travel a lot. 80 some thousand miles. The car ain't never four years old. I don't want no Starbucks. Your oh, I'm like, what in the world is that? Have y'all ever saw on Marketplace or on Facebook? Racetrack or Wawa, you can get some gas. That's the gas is pretty good. You just go down to Wawa. Which side is Wawa on? On our side. Okay. See right here, two thousand dollars. Or you can do Circle K. It was a, a twenty nineteen Honda no, Civic. That's some BS. They trying to get. Look at it, and right. they want twenty five hundred dollars. No, a twenty nineteen for a Honda no. Civic, y'all. I was like, what? Who sells a car for twenty five hundred dollars? I never saw that, and the car looks excellent. No, that's something. Yeah, no. Don't they look good? Yeah, they ain't nobody gonna sell that car for that much of that money. There's something wrong with that car. That's what I or said. Or something up there, because they were old. This and whoever had it, they probably see old money on that car. Cause so, see, don't they say two thousand? I mean, eighty thousand miles. Eighty thousand miles. I'm like, what? Mm -hmm. I didn't get it. You said, I'm sorry, where's YY at? It's going to be down, it's going to be on your right. Or you can do Circle K. I'll do Circle back. K right here. No, just do it on the way to come, come back then. Okay, you sure? Yeah. Okay. But that's crazy, ain't it? Yeah, something wrong with this car. I that's said it was probably in the flood. They selling a Honda Civic, y'all, for $2,500. Is to get you up there and hit you in your head or something. <laughs> they be selling a lot of cars on there. Everybody been jumping on that. That car went something wrong with that thing. Look at all the cars they got this one. 
3500 a 2023 Hyundai. Right. What? You know, you see, you know that <laughs> this is 2023. How right. you selling a 2023 so you're Hyundai? Lose out your, on your car. $3,500. I'm like, these cars have to be in some floods and just no good, and you're buying a lemon. Because I just That's don't a brand get new it. Car and right. You know they got some money, and you're going to sell it for $3,500. Come on. And how many miles on that one? 5,000. You selling a, you selling a brand new car. This for money down. And take over the notes on it? Probably. This is at a car dealership, so I know they ain't, man. Huh? So maybe that's $3,500 down, and then you can yeah. buy it. But if you got good credit, why you need to put any money down? Because these are not like the uh, A1 dealership. These are like these dealerships you find over on the That's crazy. How you gonna have a dealership, you're selling cars, and you're telling people $3,500 down? If your credit is A1, you shouldn't have to put down any credit. Your credit A1, you won't be dealing with them. Well, that's true too. <laughs> but I, I hear people say well, even you deal with these folks when you know your credit ain't the best. Even regular dealers, they say I don't know how true it is. I've heard it on TikTok that it's yeah, against the law. Yeah, he got one road. like the people on that um, those two girls on that uh, home remodel show. Y'all look at it. He's prejudiced. That flower shirt on. Did y'all see it? So I heard about it. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how true it is, but they said that even when you buy on a A1 a lot, a nice car, brand new car, and they're not allowed to ask you to put money down on a car. If your credit is good enough where you can take that car, buy that car. No matter if you got good credit, whatever. If you walk off the lot with a, lot, a car, they shouldn't have to tell you. Or they are, it's against the law to, for them. But they do it, and it has become a habit and a tradition that they do. Asking you first, how much money can you put down? They're not allowed to ask you how much money can you uh, put down. If you can afford the car, if your um, credit allows you to afford the car, at whatever interest rate you get that car for, they're not allowed to ask you to put down a dime. But... Mm -hmm. They do it. I heard, I heard, not true. I mean, not saying that this is true, but I heard that whatever money you put down goes toward the commission to the person that's selling the car. I don't know. That's why they be so strict on, oh, you got 2500 you got 3000 you can put down on it. So just, y'all watch TikTok. TikTok got some valuable stuff on it. <laughs> TikTok is my source of news. I don't know about y'all. You're going to get wrong. You're going to get misinformation. TikTok is my source of news. I don't know about you. She's going to get some misinformation. That's what they say on TikTok. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what they say. Be like, oh, who told you that, ma'am? That's what they said on TikTok. Where you get your news from? Shoes. Channel 5, 7, all them other new news TV stations don't be giving out accurate information as well. So, hello. They just people giving out some information. Same as TikTok. They just some people giving out information. I have some kind of credibility. Says, I mean, they supposed to, but who says that they do? They can get on there and lie to you in their face. And the bad part is when they lie, they don't even come back and apologize for li lying about it. They come back and they be like, we misspoke. No, you lie. Oh, <laughs> Tell the truth, shame the devil, my mama would say. Tell the truth. Oh my God, if I can get this. It's like, it's not a crick, but it just feels... No, it just feels crazy. It just feels crazy, y'all. See, I could have filled up there and then went, and then instead of coming back this way, I could have went around. Yeah. But then you have to turn around and go back. Right it's fine. No, because then I could have just went down NASA and came around to the expressway. Got on North Galley and got on the expressway. Right. Now I gotta come back this way yeah, and come back this one way. One is a, it's a gas station right there. 
just have to put 93 in it. That's all. No, it's a uh, um it's a, a shell coming off um off for of, um. Oh, na uh, um, um, what's the street called that I just said? Um, NASA. NASA. Right before the, um, right at that stop sign. Is that, I don't know if that's Wickham, but it's the McDonald's right there. Isn't it a Shell gas station right there? It's not a Shell station. But we can go there and put some gas and you don't have to double back this way. Let's go that way and just keep going. Gas yeah, is gas, I don't care. I think I'm having these hot flashes because I ate chocolate. I ate some, well, I didn't even eat the whole bag. I ate a couple of them. M&M's with peanuts. Oh, thank you. Let's take it. It's yours. <laughs> what am I doing? You're going to take a little piece of string that was hanging on my skirt. Talk about you want it. Well, what I'm going to do with it? My battery getting ready to die. I'll save that one. It always feels right. It don't cost nothing. A beautiful life, make it mean something. We gotta spread the love, spread the love, spread.